All right. To the individual. Hope y'all can see that. The two dicks over here, over here, over here. Look at that. Look, little penis is squirted, ejaculated it. Since I've had this car and I decided to write how I feel because social media likes to shut people down, you know. Um, I decided to put my words on the car. This is not the first time I've had my car to face. The front says, fuck you. That one was written in paint. What makes this so disturbing is because this is at the office, my office that I rent out. And you know, where I am in St. Charles off of this main street, there's not a lot of people of color that come. They're not trying to say that there aren't individuals that tend to be over here that are people that are persons of color. Majority though over here, if you are familiar with the area, a lot of the individuals that are around here are white individuals. So I'm gonna say this to the person who was brave enough to do this. I don't think it's a black person because I've driven my car into the hood in St. Louis and not one black person said anything about it. Actually, I had a lot of them come out and talk to me about it. So no, I do not think it was a black person who did this. I think it was a white liberal lefty who did this. And this is my message to you. Unlike you who like to run and hide into the abyss of nothingness, like the piece of shit that you are, because you can't say it to my face. You're definitely not man or woman enough to do that. I, unlike you, everything I believe in, I say it with my face. That's how much conviction I have and what I stand for. I'm not gonna come up to you behind your back like a little bitch and say what I need to say. No, if I'm gonna have a conversation with you, I will do it to your face. So, yeah, dumbass. I did call my landlord. <laughs> the office that I rent has a camera right outside the back door pointing to my car. That's the reason why I parked there. So come Monday when I see that footage, I'm gonna put you all on blast. You know where I be. And the fact, I don't even know if you followed me could have followed me, waited till I part. And that's what's dangerous about you. But you ain't about that life. I suggest you go look at my personal Instagram and see what type of life I'm about. Just because I look pretty and can be girly at times, don't think, don't get it twisted. Don't think I don't have a gangster side. I dare you to come, I dare you to come meet me anywhere. We can talk this out and have a nice conversation or you can be the person who I think you are, which is a fucking little bitch, a piece of shit, someone who's scared, you're like a little sheep, go wear your fucking mask. I like you, I don't give a shit about BLM. And you're the type of person who will be all about BLM and Black Lives Matter and all this other shit, but yet you will deface my car. You obviously know I'm a female, or else why would you write the shit? Why would you write whore? Hmm? Because you're a coward. You're a fucking leftist coward, and you're not about that life. So come Monday, when I'm sitting and reviewing the footage because your bitch ass is that dumb to get caught, you'll be hearing from me real soon, real soon.